comes to cryptocurrency trading and investment in general. And this is crypto updates talking about headlines where we're going to be showing you what is making the headlines radar in the crypto industry. The first is crypto market bleeds 130 billion in 12 hours as contagion continues. We all know what happened with the FTX and Binance issue and that has affected the crypto market and right now we can see right here Bitcoin price dips under 17k as 17k June low as FTX now liquidate nearly 1 billion US dollars and we can see that on the headline Sam Bank Friedman is no longer a billionaire after 14.6 billion overnight white tie whoop that's a lot of money Okay, let's continue with the headlines. We can see right here, FTX, FTT token crashes 78% in the last 24 hours and Bitcoin hit yearly low. And that's why some back free mind is no longer a billionaire thing. FTX token fallout 80% despite Binance bailout as Alameda contagion spread to Bitcoin. Also on the radar, we have this news, NFL legend, Tom Brandy caught in FTX fallout. Rick's losing complete strategic investment. You need to be careful, guys. Another headline is another headline is Binance CEO promised to implement proof of reserve after run on FTX. Another headline, guys, is Binance top up emergency insurance fund SAFU to one billion US dollars after BNB volatility. Wow, Binance is doing a lot. Cracking and Coinbase suffers connectivity issued and made market crash. We can see another news on the headline right here. Over 334, excuse me, over 344 million liquidated as Binance and Ethereum continue to drop. We can see another headline right here. Alameda respond to beat down allegation proves 100 million bit token holdings. Another headline on the radar is crypto exchange Gemini expand to five more European countries. And speaking about countries, uh, Robin Hood is down with 20% for, excuse me, Robin Hood is down 20% after Binance announces FTX acquisition. And we can saw that was trending on Twitter yesterday. Another news on the radar I would like to share with you right now is Coinbase CEO say company does not have any material exposure to FTX or Alameda. Let's check some other headline out. We can see right here, Dogecoin Shiba Inu Plument as crypto market shares 44 billion overnight. And we can even see it's more than that because we've seen uh, it's about 130 billion that was wiped out of the market in 24 hours. Solana token down double. Solana token down double digits as NFT growth plummet. Another news on the airline is Sequins case against LBR. What does that mean for Ripple? Another headline is um, another news on the airline. Excuse me. Investor increasingly confident of Ripple victory over SEC. We're still going to look out for that. Fed update tornado cash sanction. Site North Korea nuclear weapon program. And we can see Fed sees about 3.36 billion crypto linked to Silk Road. Wow, that is too much. And another headline I have for you on the radar is Japan largest telecom company entity to invest. 4 billion US dollar into Web3. Let's take a look at another headline. Bash Bank of Russia suggests NFT smart contract regulations. We're going to see more of that. Speaking about Russia, Russia Central Bank report examines crypto place in financial system. Let's check out another headline. Germany financial regulator orders Coinbase to address business organization practices. And we can see Dubai press for crypto companies to set up shop. And we can also see over here, let's check another headline. Blockify is bringing back 
yield pro double there is a catch they did that nine months ago and they were in trouble let's check out another headline mastercard ceo explain when cryptocurrency will become mainstream let's take a look at another headline guys nigeria's presidential candidates are the buyer to create 30 million job using cryptocurrency we can't wait to see that and we can see Saku announces euro coin euro expansion to solana blockchain us dog sees over 50,000 btc related to silk road let's check out some nft but apes founder proposed new model for nft creator royalty and we can see kim kardashian and floyd Mayweather set to win Ethereum Max lawsuit. And let's check one more NFT out. OpenSea Roy's NFT market with enforcement tools for creators. That's what I've got to you. That's what I've got for you on the headlines this morning. And if you've not subscribed to the channel, you might want to do that so you can get more of these headlines coming to your view. I still remain myself. I made a lot of magic Kazim and it's peace out.